figured that out. Sorry for those of you waiting. I see uh, there's quite a few of you still waiting. Some people have already liked. I appreciate that. I haven't really done anything. But um, this is kind of a last minute thing. Let me get this set up because I almost thought, because I, I set everything up ahead of time on here with the description, trying to make a thumbnail and stuff, which I just finished. It's pretty fire, if you ask me. Uh, but, so, and I tried to heat up my coffee. Check out this cup, number one, Dad. Hopefully it's not backwards for you guys. I'm not sure how you see it. But today we have a bucket of water and we're going to hydro dip and my head's cut off. Literally. What's up, Grady? How you doing, everybody? Thanks for everybody coming on. Like I said, this is last minute uh, decision. I was going to make a video, like a full video, but then I decided uh, I'll just go live and do it with you because this was your suggestion. If you remember, you're here because I did this lamp, right? Tons of comments coming in. Hey, hey, everybody, how you doing? Remember this lamp from the last video where I put on my turner and I epoxied? I literally did not know if that would work or not. I had it in my mind and I could see it and I wanted to do it. So that's what I did. And whew, if you haven't seen this video, you need to check this out. Look at how beautiful that thing came out. Oh, gosh, there we are. Look at that sparkly alpha links. That turned out crazy. So, with this being so beautiful, I had this Mentrosti. It was brown. And I went ahead and sprayed it gold. And when I sprayed it gold, I got extremely nervous because I don't even know what this is. Is it like fabric? Should I sand it? Should I wipe it? I don't know because it's fabric. Uh, but I went ahead and spray painted it gold, and when I did, it kind of looked really, really splotchy. But if you can see, let me back this light up here, because it is not in a good spot. The light, there we go, look at that. It actually flattened out and leveled and actually looks really nice. You can't see how much is reflecting in here, but that's that th this gold paint right here that I used in my Indiana Jones video. Have you seen that? Have you guys seen that? If you haven't seen that video, it's definitely worth watching. This is probably one of my shortest videos ever. It's like under four minutes. So I was trying to decide <clears throat> what to do with this guy. And all of you in the comments said, hydro dip it, hydro dip it. So here we are. Per your request, we're going to hydro dip. Uh, I'm going to try to pick out colors. I think this close to this so it'll kind of match maybe and not clash too much i hope i hope hey how's the sound doing can y'all give me some uh, comments on the sound i do have a microphone that i can hook up <clears throat> we'll see if that could be any better where'd my comments Let's go there they are how's the sound doing sounds good or let's see let's try this and see if it's any better oh sounds good here you find okay well i won't mess with it then you sound far away. Okay, that's what I was wondering about. All right. Now, now I have this. How's this? Is this better? These are things if I go live more often, we'd work out, you know. Much better. Okay, cool, cool. I like I like to sound better. Whatever. I guess I'll just clip this mug right here. Hello, everybody. All right, now, before, so this, I want it to be pretty good. So I don't want to screw it up. So I'm, I got I got a few things. And this piece right here, if you remember, it's the top of this lamp piece that shows up. I had to remove it so I could fit it onto my turner. So I want to hydro dip this. I thought about putting it on my turner and doing exactly what I did to that. But then I'm like, eh. You guys said hydro dip, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to hydro dip. And to test it out before that, I figured we'd just test it on a couple pair of shoes. How about that? These are like super El Cheapo $7 Walmart shoes. Uh, they definitely are way too small for me. I think they're a size 6 in the ladies. It's popular with the teachers. That's what I hear. I don't know. I just go with it. And for our dripping pleasures we have a lot of these uh, easy marble inks it is much easier in my opinion to use these than the spray paint spray paint is a hit or miss 
And I was looking back on my channel and a lot of times I went and did hydro dip and I was live, except for this one. How many of you have seen this video right here where I hydro dipped the skateboard and then I airbrushed it? I actually had to use a trash can for this because it's so big. But look at that beautiful hydro dippiness. I think I only used um, black and red actually. Just one black, one red, and it turned out fantastic. If you hadn't seen that video, it's way back on the channel. Go take it a go take a peek. What was that? Hmm. So now let's pick out our colors and get going. So I know I, dominant is pink, so I might just use like every pink that I have. I have multiples of some. Put in the comments, have you ever used these easy marbles or hydro dipped with spray paint? Do you like it? Which one do you like better? This is neon pink and rosa pink. And then we have another neon and probably another rose, I would imagine. Yeah, so I have two of those of each. So those two are definites. What else we got here? Got some nice purple or purple, depends on. I better get some gloves. I don't want to be all rainbowy colored dippy, you know what I'm saying? Let's see, I've watched your videos way back to the beginning before all this. Oh, so you probably saw the PewDiePie skateboard where I airbrushed it and hydro dipped it. Not in that order. Let's see, what's this color look like? I have literally no idea what these will look like. Should I dip the shoes like the lamp so that I can fine tune the colors? I think that's a good idea. Appreciate that comment, that recommendation. Ultra marine dark blue might be too dark but it is pretty dark down here so that might work definitely want a nice azul it's just another it's just spanish for blue it's not really a name for a color but whatever we'll go with it i'm really nervous about the yellows and orange mixing in here oh do you see the the goldy yellow oh i'm not sure about that should i do it that's lemon let's go with more like a sunny yellow like um i don't know how to say that word mitt lead jib medium blue i mean yellow that's why nothing and don't forget you gotta shake all these before you start swirling oh my gosh i don't know why i get so nervous when i go to start dripping and dipping because uh i feel like if it messes up, you can spray paint it and dip it again, or you can just dip it again. I've seen uh, Celia, the lady from Maribu, Maribu that I went to TumblrCon with last year. She is a dipping master. She can just dip it. Oh, oh, it's screwed up. No problem. She has an accent. And she dip it again. She, she's, she's, a, she's a master dipper. That's the thing. All right, I'm, I feel like I don't have enough colors. We gotta get some more colors. What are, give me some color suggestions. If you don't, if it don't work, paint it black and do whatever. Or I painted this one gold. I could probably spray it back gold or black or white or whatever, huh? Let's get some gloves. I don't want to be striped up everywhere. There we go. Safety first. I got my paper towels over here to skim the top. I have done this a time or two, but I always get so nervous when it comes to dipping. I don't even know why. It's just, it should be relaxing and fun, you know? But I guess maybe it's because I have so many of you watching. So it is the middle of the day here on the East Coast. Where's everybody from? And what, what are you doing? Are you supposed to be working, huh? Some of you are supposed to be working, I know. But I appreciate you taking your lunch break or just sneaking off and watching me. We'll maybe have a disaster with this lampshade lid. These are the right size, I promise. There, there we go. All right, Kansas, Orlando. Ooh, I love Orlando. I love Orlando. That's one of my favorite places. Let's have a coffee break, shall we? Mm. I had a Bob Ross cup. It was one of those where it gets hot and it changes, like it's a black cup and it, uh, Tampa, oh, I love Indian Rock Shores and that area right there. Oh, we love going vacation there. But anyway, the cup's black and it changes to a Bob Ross painting when it gets hot, but I broke it. Oh, you're not supposed to put them in the dishwasher. Here's a note. Hmm, I could drink coffee all day. Is that? Uh, 
Y'all hear that? Sounds like we're getting Amazon delivery. I'm never mad at those. All right, we need an orange. I don't want a neon orange, no. Is that neon? It's kind of muted. I'll go with that. There is some gold in there, but the gold is the base. And we have orange. Let's just go with that. Let's try that. I was just throwing this light purple. There are so many colors. I don't think you're supposed to use this many colors, but we're going to try it. It could either go bad, really bad, or it could be great. I don't know. How else are we going to find out, right? Purple, purple, pink, pink. Take all the lids off. And for the shoes, I was going to tape up the bottom, but I forgot. And I don't have any time right now, so I'm not going to tape up the bottom. You know, around the edges down here. That's normally what I would do is tape off that rubber part, but I guess we could probably do that real quick. I'm pretty quick at it. I love all my assortments of tape. Look at, look at this. I have a drawer of just tapes and um, these set right here. I haven't had it in a, in a link for a video for a while, but literally I got all these in one kit pack from Amazon. If you go to my, in the description, I actually have a link to my Amazon store and I have these in there. It's like so many different sizes. It's like five or six different sizes. It was like nine bucks for all of these. It was insane. Crazy price. Uh, a lot of people like to use this uh, electric tape for taping the soles up, I guess because it's pretty stretchy. We'll go with that. I hope it works. I don't really care if it does or does not. I'm not going to wear them because they don't fit me. So I'm a size 11 to 12-ish, usually 11s. And I cannot wear a lady's size 6. But if you can and you like these shoes, throw me a comment. We might work something out and send it to you. Right? Especially if they turn out good, I hope. All right, let's tape these bad boys up. The only thing I do to tape these up is I kind of butt it up against the... I, li I like to leave a little bit if, I, if I'm in a hurry. Usually I try to butt it up right against there, and if you get it close and then pull, it'll kind of wrap the rest of the way over. And if I was making like a legit YouTube video, I'll do some fancy close-ups and show you how getting it close and doing all that jazz. But literally, you get the idea. I'm just doing this just so it'll look a little cleaner. Like, I feel like if it gets on there a little bit, it's not gonna be that big a deal. Plus, you can uh, take some mineral spirits, probably. I'd have to see what would take it off. Probably a little acetone. You gotta be careful with the acetone next to the, uh, where it's glued. I feel like it'll make the glue come off. Not be, you know, these things are held on with glue and hopes and promises. There we go, one taped up all the way around. And then we just give a little, you could cut it or pull it. I like pulling it, it doesn't matter. It'll actually pull really straight and clean. Can you see that line? Can you see the line, Russ? Sure can, Dad. Who knows what movie that's from? That's hilarious. Uh, nope, can't see the line, can you, Russ? Sure can, not Dad. If you don't know, I'll go ahead and tell you. Uh, National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation, a classic. How many of you, uh, I know a lot of you, everybody that's on here probably watches my videos, but how many of you enjoy the short cut up or you like, you would probably rather like a little longer, more uh, maybe live version of showing steps and details and just hanging out really is what we're doing right now. You know what I'm saying? Cause I'm just taping up a shoe. Uh, I am, as I'm doing things and I think of stuff, I like to give you tips that might help you. So that's, even if you're not going to do this, it could help with the taping up anything. You might be making like your kid has a project for school and you might just be helping them tape something up and Hey, I, Duncan showed me how to tape this stuff and butt it up, pull it. If you pull it and wrap around and keep it tight, boom. I'm here to simplify steps and make life easier for you. A lot of you saying live, live, I like live. Look at how clean that is. 
You can just leave that muscle. Just wear these around like that. I got some red soles. You start that make you start dancing when you got some red soles on you. I don't even know. All right, let's shake these bad boys back up. Can y'all hear that? I haven't used these in a while, so I might better give a little extra shake, do a little shake dance. We need some music. Somebody play some music. What are you doing? I'm literally here by myself. Nobody's helping me today. I usually have a camera person. Bailey's usually around here somewhere, but she's at some, uh, at the dance place. She's not dancing because she broke her arm. I don't know if many of you know that little girl, Bailey. She was in my coffee video. She sabotaged my, my coffee tumbler so she could win. I'm just kidding. She didn't do that on purpose. But she was racing, running at Vacation Bible School, not my church, but a friend of ours' church, Harrison, our neighbor. And she was running through the bouncy house obstacle courses. And she decided, there's the exit, there's the win, I'm going to win. She dove through it, over shot the landing pad, you know, the big, nice, soft, fluffy thing that's full of air, and landed on the grass, caught herself with the arm, and broke both the bones right here. But she went to the dance place because they have Scaly Adventures. There's this group from around here that takes around reptiles and whatnot. All right, so where's the clear one? I might want to throw some clear in here just to... Get it. Uh, no, I think I'll. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to. There's some floating in the water. Uh, it's not. I don't guess it's really necessary for you guys to see the water. I can't move it. So there's some some particles floating on the top of the water. Let's just throw that there for now for later. So what I think I'm going to do is not neon. I'm going to. I'm going to lay a base color down of rosa. Because this is majority pink, it just makes sense to me. Uh, but this is for the shoes for right now. Uh, and one trick could probably be the hard thing is getting um, enough out. A lot of people don't put enough for their first. And Celia said, you put a lot. You put a lot. Put more than you think. You know, a lot of people don't put enough. So there's a Rosa. Let's go ahead with the uh, Lavendale. Why does it say Lavendel? It's Lavender. Must be a different language. I don't know. You know how I do with pronouncing words and names and colors and it's not really that good. This stuff, it's pretty strong. Pretty strong. Let's just leave it open. I might come back to them. Next color, the orange. I'm really, I really don't want to do the orange. I'm going to be honest with you, but we have to because it's, it's on the thing. I'm not going to do very much orange at all. At all. I don't want any much orange. So I think it's going to be hideous. This is the yaller. Or some people call it yellow. Whatever. Drip, 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 drip. You know, this is kind of fun. Just throwing paint in water too and dripping. Let's go with the neon pink. I think that one's going to, I think that one's going to pop. I think it's going to be nice. Let's shake it a little shaky. There we go. I think you... Man, Celia gave me some tips last year while she was doing this because she did live demos at um, the TumblrCon last year. I wasn't able to go this year, but you know, it's fine. This is, this is that dark, dark blue. Try to be sparing with that too. I don't know. I really don't know how this is going to turn out. This is the other blue. It's uh, azul blue, regular blue. Let's see how this is going and we're about ready to dip the shoe. I meant to bring some toothpicks, darn it. I guess I'll use the back of this extra long paintbrush. And we'll do some swirl, ooh, whoa. Okay, that's looking nice. I'm not really sure if it really will after I dip it, but in the water, it's looking pretty nice. I wish you could see this, I'm sorry. Okay, let's, I hope this works with the shoe. Here goes nothing. So for the shoe, I use the, oh, the tape's coming off right here. I didn't pull it tight enough, or too tight, maybe. So for the shoe, I usually like to hold here, go down at a 45. It's just theory. I've heard other people doing it, so I figure it probably works. You know what I'm saying? And then we're going to dip. Are you ready? This is the nerve-wracking part. Let's go. Just do it. Just do it, dude. Just do it. Let it nice and slow. 
evenly. If you see a spot you like, you can twist it to try to catch that spot. Ooh, no look dip. Oh, you hear that? It's filling up with water. It's getting happy. Whoa, watch out. Watch out. I'm slinging water over here. Yeah, you might want to put on your rain jacket. All right. I cleared the water out. What I'm doing is clearing the water out with my other hand. You ready? Are you, are you sure? I don't even know if I'm ready. This thing's got tons of air in it coming. What? Look at that. Okay. That is pretty cool. So think of this. Where it's white here is where uh, there was no paint. You can control that by putting using clear but that'll be with the lamp where it's gold what that looks like this looks like a picasso what oh you look at that oh my gosh i thought that was going to be hideous that's beautiful oh i hope i can remember what i did to put the other one it has a lot of light paint i might do the base, the neon paint for the lamp. But for this, oh, look at that. Wow. At the end, I'll come over on that side and I'll show you a little better. But for now, I'm gonna set this to the side. It's still kind of heavy, I guess, because it's wet. And I'll back the light up so you can see. Wow, hold on, let me hold it right here. What? And every part of it's covered too. Oh, another pointer. Uh, before I did this, I took out the insoles because I figured they'd just get waterlogged, you know, and they don't need color. So, wow, that's a winner. Let's, let's hope we can get the second one to do just as good. Uh, now, now there's even more pressure to that. That looks dope. I love that. That looks really cool. Okay, remember what you did. Oh, we got to clean off the water. Don't forget that. I, I learned that from watching the Thirsty Turtle Tumblers. If you know who the Thirsty Turtle Tumblers are, they are fantastic. They go live every single weeknight on TikTok at eight, eight o'clock Eastern. And <clears throat> they hydro dip. They've been doing a lot of, uh, I'll get that later. A lot of, uh, what's it called? Power washing, drizzle, dizzle, dawning, all that good stuff. Uh, but they live about an hour and a half. I went and surprised them one night during one of their live feeds. They had no idea I was coming. It was hilarious. It was awesome. But uh, yeah, wow, that, that worked great. I'm seeing some stuff floating around on the top. I, my OCD says I got to get it all. I don't know if you have to or not, but what did you think about the shoe? Oh, you just do it like that. And then pick it up on the side. Nice, okay. So just drape it. Don't try to like grab it with the, the paper towel. I don't know if you can see. I'll try to open that up. You can see the stuff coming off there. You can't, yeah, you kind of see the little specks. Oh, I'm dripping everywhere. Raincoats, people, I told you. Wear your raincoat. All right, let's see if we can get the second one to do just as good as the first one. You think? You love it. Awesome. So I don't know what the time frame is for these, but I feel like before I do a drip, I feel like two need to shake. You know what I'm saying? Shake. I use this one, this one, the orange. I use a little bit of that, a little bit of that. And that, where's that? Did I not use the purple? I did use the purple. There it is. Okay. You're trying to hide from me, little booger. All right, put the lids on, shake them. Hey, listen, don't shake them without the lids on, okay? It could be could be dangerous to your health and to your environment. Get paint. I mean, it might make everything look beautiful. I don't know. All right, now this is the clear I did not use because it did pretty good. Did good. It's enough gold in there, or the base showing through. Go, 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 go. To look golden enough for the lamp shade. Before we do lampshade, <laughs> that was funny. I was shaking it and talking. Before we do lampshade, uh, we need a coffee break. Oh, I hope I don't get paint on my coffee cup because uh, paint is all over my gloves. Mmm. Ah, that's good. Yeah, you might be wondering why are you not using a fancy tumbler? I don't know. My hands fit really nicely in this handle, I guess. And it says I'm number one dad. So if you, you know, you, you, if you tell people that, people will eventually begin to believe that, okay? Hmm. Very good, very good, very good. And when I'm done with this, any of these things that I'm dipping today, well, this and the lampshade goes with the lamp. If you want it, 
if you're interested maybe in purchasing it i don't know uh shoot me a message on instagram okay or you can go to my website and shoot me a contact form there's plenty of ways any of this stuff i do on my channel if you're interested in it or if you want to send me something to do uh and if especially if you got requests hey do it live i want to see you do this live that sounds fun to me let's do it let's do it let's make it happen right so we got a shake 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 oh look at that i got them all in one hand oh those are pretty pretty like that eli just burped did y'all hear that varmint no i'm just kidding he's cool more room out than in right we start with rosa was that correct tell me if i'm wrong let's see let's see me to it's a good youtube day i guess for notifications good i'm glad you got it look i've heard a lot of you are not getting the notifications for when i drop videos i'll be done put out like three videos four videos in a row like weekly consistently and somebody will comment saying oh so glad to see you uh doing making videos again i'm thinking i've been making videos where you, where you been but what you do is when it, if you go, you see where it says subscribe. <clears throat> if you're already subscribed, uh, there's a, it'll be gray, I think. And if you click on that, you'll see a bunch of bells pop up. Click the one at the top to get all notifications. And then if you're not, if you, if you're a person that like me that has your notifications turned off on your phone, even though that bell notification is on, you you might not get the notification but you need to go into your settings <clears throat> and allow the notifications for YouTube, okay? Then maybe, yeah, I get that a lot. A lot of people literally have to just go to my channel and look. Okay, here we go. Boop, 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 boop. This is Rosa Pink. Rosa makes me want to say salsa. I should have counted drips huh maybe i don't know that i feel like that's enough is that enough i think okay now what did i do next i think i did a little bit well, let's i didn't get this side over here get to the side sir there we go okay oh that's another way if you don't have anything to mix it up you just give the bucket a few little taps and it'll just wiggle and swirl all right so we got the uh lavendel right sure buddy lavendel all right now next we have <clears throat> i think we went with the the little bit of orange i wonder if the order of these things matter as much because i'm trying to do about the same amount maybe in not the same order but I'm, I'm pretty close pretty sure that i got it pretty close and what i'm doing here is with that yellow yaller trying to get close and do a drip inside the orange to try and mimic that as best as possible. I don't know if it'll work or not. <clears throat> Neon pink. This is, should be beautiful colors with the neon pink. I'm putting a little more on this one, I think. I don't know. We'll see. Now I gotta do the two blues. The dark blue I didn't do very much of, remember? Just drip, 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 because I'm scared of it. It makes me nervous. And then I put the the regular azul on here, right? So let's see. Drip, 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 drip. Oh, I don't think I put that much last time. Fingers crossed. Here we go. Let's uh oh, let's wipe our paintbrush off the tip so we could swirl again. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Woo wee. This is. It shouldn't it, look. I feel like if you did it more often, if I did it more often, that swirls so nice though. That's so cool. That's fun. Okay, I think I'm going with that. I love it. Maybe I think I do. I don't know. Throw that to the side. We'll get that later. All right, here we go, big guy. You got it. You got this. Don't be nervous. Am I talking to the shoe or myself? Yes. Okay, here we go. 45 degree angle, upside down, grab by the sole and just go. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Easy does it, buddy. Don't be scared. It's just water. I mean, you can be scared of water. You should be scared of water if you don't, can't swim or something. Twist it to the side. I'm, a, I'm in. I'm in. I'm in all the way. <sighs> here we go. It's bubbling. There's happy things happening under here. Literally, once you get through, it's done. Uh... 
I say the funniest, stupidest things. I make myself laugh if I don't make anybody else laugh. Listen, if you're here and you don't do art, or you, you can. Literally, that's what I'm here for. I'm here to show you that you can do art. It doesn't have to be anything complicated or fancy or, you know. You can do that literally that dip with your kids. This is better than the spray paint because, um, I'm gonna take a peek. Oh, it looks the same, I think. I think, I think, I think, I think, I think, I think. Okay, you can literally do this with your kids with this dip stuff because with spray paint, you know, it's blows up everywhere and fogs up the room. It's a hit or miss. I feel like this stuff is more dependable, reliable, consistent. <clears throat> Are you ready? Still bubbling here. Whew, the main thing is to not go nice and slow. Don't, don't, because if you do like that, you're pushing all the inks away. Just go nice and slow, steady. Act like you know what you're doing, okay? That makes a difference. So here we go, let's pull it out. Oh, the tape looks cool at least. I think I, whoa, what happened to the toe? The toe just went um, straight. The underside's really cool. The toe didn't get as cool as that one, but the sides did. Well, this side over here, this is what I wanted the front to look like. Okay, maybe I aimed in the wrong spot. Oh, that's sick. Look at that. The toe did something crazy, um, like straight. Mm. I guess it works. It still matches. It literally still matches. But uh, I wish that was on the front. So that's the thing to think about. I kind of didn't really think about my beginning point starting at the coolest looking spot. But it also, I feel like um, if we were to do this on a regular basis, if you wanted to do this, maybe a white bucket would work better because this is blue and it really messes with what you're seeing in the water. That makes a lot of sense to me. Uh, this bucket was literally cheap. It was like a, a dollar or two at Ace Hardware. So <clears throat> that's things you don't think about before you do this stuff to start. But look at that. That is awesome. Let's do both of them together. Come here, guy. Or gal. I guess you're gal because you're girl shoes. Oh. At the end of this, I'm going to take the tape off. Hope I don't mess them up. But that one looks so sick. This one, the toe doesn't look that great. Can you do it again? Should I do it again? Should I do it again? Will it work on t-shirts? I have no idea. That's a good question. What kind of paint are you using? I'm using uh, Easy Marble by Marabou. Easy Marble by Marabou. <clears throat> you know, I kind of want to do the toe again, but then I don't. Because it's cool, you got two different shoes. They don't have to look exactly the same. They, they're similar and they match. I feel like that's good enough. You know what I'm saying? Because if you're pretty satisfied with it, but you wish it would be a little different. Well, sometimes it's good to experiment and try to get exactly what you're wanting. Other times it's good to leave well enough alone. You got to know when to quit. Hold on. Does, do you have to seal the shoes? Uh, I don't think so with Marabou. Per Celia from Marabou. Uh, she says this stuff dries and is pretty, um, what do you call it? Permanent. But if you wanted to, I would suggest maybe some scotch. What's that spray with the seals, the, uh, the clothes from waterproofing? Scotch guard. That's it. Thank you. <clears throat> A lot more blue on this one. Not as much on that one. I'm still happy with it. I'm still not, I'm not mad about it at all. You know, I didn't realize I put that much blue on the first one. But, hey, we're not pros at this. We're just playing around here right you might think I'm I'm professional at a lot of things airbrushing yeah okay but hydro dipping I ain't done enough of it to do to to really mess with it let's see does the process work with polymer something I, I didn't catch that before it went away um, so per Celia it literally works on everything. She dipped a pair of sunglasses. She dipped some cups. She dipped some shoes. She dipped some picture frames, wood, metal, plastic. She literally did it on everything. I don't. I didn't sell my granddaughters. They're still very colorful. Nice. See? Yeah. So she said, uh, "Yeah, I've done tumblers before. I've hydro dipped tumblers. Uh, I would get one if my hands weren't so messy. I don't want to, you know, stain it up." All right, the next thing, before we jump to the big final lampshade, I might change my gloves before I do that, but 
I'll get that later. Uh, the other part of the lamp, this will be, this will be a good test to tell how well these colors will show up and match the actual lamp. Okay. <clears throat> and for that, I probably will seal that. You can seal that with like some, this is glossy. So I might not use the matte clear. I might would use some gloss clear or you could epoxy it if you want to. It's up to you. I, I mean, I don't know what you prefer. A lot of people ask, hey, do you have to epoxy cups? Do you have to seal it with this? Uh, you have to do something. For the cups, if you're going to use it and like drink out of it and everything, sealing it with uh, just the Mate Clear A or gloss spray paint is not efficient, sufficient enough. So a lot of these, I have my buddy Thomas Clear Coat, if I don't epoxy. He does automotive industrial clear coat. I say industrial, but it's just automotive paint. And before I ever touched epoxy, that's the only thing I did with tumblers and uh, everything is just used automotive clear coat. I did notice I left a few little particles. It's really hard to get all these little pieces out. There needs to be, there's probably a, a better, more efficient way than dragging a paper towel through, but I just don't know what it is. You should do a ball cap. That would be cool. I, I like the one I have. This is a Columbia. It's very, it's a, I don't want to do this when I like it a lot. I don't want to screw it up. But, oh, at the Great American Craft Expo last year, they did a uh, strainer. That'd be a good idea. They did free hat dippings with Marabou because they were there as a... Um, so... They did free hat dippings. You got to sign up, you dip it, and it's free. You got to keep it when it dried. It was pretty cool. That's a cool thing to do for free. I mean, sweet. It worked really good. Like literally, fabrics and all. This is the neon I'm starting with. Hopefully, it'll do, it doesn't show up very much at all. Come on, neon, pop out for me. I literally don't see anything on this water. I can see just a little bit, like a little bit of something, but it's not really jumping out at me. Now we're going to do the Rosa. You can really see this guy or gal. Rosa, that's a female. We name our paints. We give them personification. Wow, look at that. My hand's sticky to the cap. There we go. Now this is just going to be for that little piece. The little, um, wow, I got this crap everywhere. The little top slider part of the, uh, I think I did orange next, right? The lamp, Whew, the orange makes me nervous. I feel like there's not gonna be very much pink on here because I can't see that hot pink. That's a lot of orange. What are you doing, man? Talking, not paying attention, I'm sorry. You usually, hopefully when you're doing this, you're not demonstrating to people how to do it so they can see how not to do it. That was a lot of yellow too. Eli, bless you, sir. He just sneezed. Do you find, if you that work from home or just hang out, it's hard to get stuff done when the kids are home, isn't it? Can I get an amen there? <laughs> no, that's okay. Bailey's at the Scaly Adventure people. And Eli is here sneezing. At least he's not playing Fortnite and yelling. He does that a lot. He likes to yell. I wish I, I do have another purple. There we go. Where have you been, guy? Gal? Purple? It could be guy or gal. Um, dude perfect, that guy's favorite color is purple. All right. <clears throat> that is really dark. Did I do orange? I did orange. I didn't do the blues yet. Yes, I did. Did I? I did the dark blue. I see the dark blue. I didn't do the light blue. All right. Amen, hallelujah. Mine are pets. Oh, Paisley. All she does is sleep. She literally, like, I feel like I did that color already. Looks like it. We're just going to go with more pink for the topper because I feel like, I feel like I need more pink because this is majority pink. You hear him in there? Screaming, hollering. He's he's laughing. He's watching something on the video. And maybe the neon will show up now. I don't know. I hope so. I hope this uh, whole lid will fit in there. 
I tested it with an empty and it fits, but I don't know to the degree. All right, now we do a little stir around. Ooh, I'm doing a big stir for this one, like all the way across, up, down, maybe across one time here. Oh, that's too much. Okay, maybe not. So if you like the pattern you see in the water, try to cover all the areas. I've seen them where they, they'll take it and attach it to the sides so it kind of sticks. So I'm not sure if that's a thing or if it works, but I've seen them do it, so I'm going to do it and hope for the best. Here we go. Oh, I'm not doing the lid yet. I'm just doing this little guy. Oh, that should be the lid. I guess we got to do it again. Okay, little guy, this is your turn. Let's see how you look. So what I'm going to do, I'm just talking it out. I don't know if this is right or wrong. When I put it in, I'm going to kind of twist it. When I put it in, let's shove it on my finger really tight so it doesn't come off because I literally can't hold it other than that. I guess I could do this. But let's go. We're going to dip in and twist. That was very short because that is... Why do I use that hand? That's my cleaning hand. I don't know. Swirl around. Come on, baby. Don't fail me now. Swirl it. Clean it with this hand. Here we go. So what, you're, what I'm doing is I'm getting all the excess ink out of the way so when I pull it back up, I'm not rehydrating it again. You know what I'm saying? There we go. Okay. That's nice. The gold is popping through very nicely. What, co what color is that? Is that that orange? How did that turn like rusty brown orange? I guess because it's on the... How am I going to get this off my finger? Hmm. I didn't think about that. But I'm going to show you right quick. Look at that. You can kind of go by my finger. I'll sh Again, I'll show you this stuff up close. Come, come. Dude, I, I'm attached here. I'm attached. I'm coming around. I'm coming around. Hang on. Hang on. You got to see this. Back it up, Terry. There's my face. Here we go. Turn in the light. There we go. Look at that. Okay. That's nice. Still a lot of that um, rosy pink color. I really... Come here. Nobody can see with you over there, man. I really would like to figure out how to get more of the bright pink. I don't know why the neon's not really showing up. Like I literally don't see any of the neon pink at all. But it turned out good. It worked, right? <clears throat> How big is your screen that you read across the room? Uh, it's very small, actually. I have a, a Samsung Galaxy 22, I think it is. I think it's a 22. So there we are. I literally was trying to get my um, iPad, but it was dead because I usually keep it um, to the side over here so I can read comments, but this was not planned that far ahead of time. I was going to actually just do that. I was setting up to actually just film a video. Let's see if I can grab this with this. I need some pliers. I got some tweezers. Maybe that'll work. Don't screw it up. Why did I put that on so tight? Oh yeah, so it wouldn't drop in the water, I guess. Here is a paint popper. Just reach in there and grab. Nope, that didn't work. Oh, it is on there. It is on there good. Dude, what the? Okay, I got it. Oh, oh don't drop it. Don't drop it. Take it easy. Easy there, buddy. There you go. And we're down. Oh, it literally looks just like the shoes, aside from the gold background to the white background of the shoes. So I'm not really mad about that. I just really wish, hey, get off the cord there. I really wish it was the bright pink color. Maybe I don't have the right color. I literally thought neon would show like that. What was that? Drop something here. Let me, let me double check these pinky colors. Make sure that they are the same. There's Rosa and there's neon. Yeah, I guess maybe they have some more colors that I don't have. I could have swore I got every color that they had. For the lamp, I'm switching gloves here. I'm going clean. I'm cleaning it off. I'm really nervous about the lampshade. I don't want to screw it up. I guess you could probably buy another lampshade, but literally I paid $3 for the entire lamp. So I feel like if I bought a lampshade, it'd probably cost more than I paid for the whole lamp. Right? <laughs> this is an important step. I mean, if you go start dipping, you'll see there's a bunch of hazy floaty around -y thingies on the water. It's probably a technical term there. Floaty around -y thingies. Probably Google it. But if you don't get those off, 
it'll show up on your thing and probably be like clumps, you know, splat. That's fun. I kind of enjoy throwing the wet paper towels down. I'm not going to be, not going to lie. Okay, let's try to widen this bad boy out and just lay it across the water. Drag, drag it all up. Get it all. I feel like I'm using a lot of paper towels to get all this crap out of the water. What do you think? Hey, you guys, if you, and this is, this is like a, a assignment for you. If you hydro dip with water, marabou inks, whatever, if you watch this video and you try hydro dip, and I want to see these things, if you do it, post it on TikTok or Instagram or go in my, join my private Facebook group and show us. I want to see, tag me, let me know. I enjoy seeing you guys' creations. If you watch any of my videos or you just want to show me something, that's, I love seeing it. I, I, I try to view everything and answer all the comments and, you know, sometimes can't get to everything or sometimes the stupid notifications don't work like a lot of you know. But if you uh, use a piece of cardboard, that would be a good idea if I had one next time, catch it. But uh, if you paint, post, whatever, TikTok, Instagram, my private Facebook group, uh, I believe most of my videos have it in the description for you to join those things. Not the, the, the only thing would be the Facebook group. OK, but if you don't see it in this video or another video, just go to another video, watch the whole thing, and then look in the description and see uh, the join Facebook group, the private Facebook group. It's free. It doesn't cost anything. Okay? So, I, I'm trying to get the water really good on this one because I'm really nervous. So nervous I need a coffee break. Ooh. You know, it's just the smell and the taste. Even though it's freezing cold coffee right now. <laughs> It's still relaxing, isn't it? Yeah, just the smell of it's nice. Just, you get nervous, have some coffee. Hmm. Oh yeah, I feel good now, let's go. Let's get uh, another pair of gloves. You know, you could try cheap out and just use one. I wouldn't recommend it, just get two. It's, it's not that big a deal. And uh, the ones I use, a lot of you ask, hey, where do you get the black ones? Uh, like I said, in the description, my Amazon store, just go to it. I got all this cool stuff that I use saved in my Amazon store. The Marabou Easy Marbles are saved there. What's the super secret password? Oh, the super secret password. Okay, that's a funny thing. There's no password, okay? I just did that to see and what kind of funny answers you guys come up with. And it also shows me if, you, uh, if you've watched for a while, you might put Mate Clear A or Flamenco or airbrushing or Duncan's cool. I don't know. I accept all those. Or if you don't put anything, I'll still let you in. As long as your profile don't look sketchy or scammy, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> but it's a funny thing. Uh, I thought it was Tumblr. That would work. You would, you would get in with Tumblr. I, so the funny thing, that's so funny. People always like, it freaks them out because it's, it's kind of stressful. You're like, oh crap, what's the password? I don't know what the password is. But there's no password. I just did it for my amusement. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, it's funny. But it is funny. A lot of people freak out on that password. Like, oh, I, I answered the questions and I, I didn't know what the password is. I'm not going to get in. But if you, if you just submit to join, you don't even have to answer the questions, really. There's like, are you subscribed to Duncan Custom Airbrush on YouTube? And what's the secret password? I think that's the two questions. I just thought that was hilarious. I'm a prankster gangster like that. I can't help it. Okay, sorry. This is neon. Is this neon? Oh boy, I don't know. We're gonna pretend. It? Yeah, it is. Oh, that's not neon. Okay. Here's another thought. Don't mix up your lids. Okay. Hello. Thank you for joining. We have dipped some items here, and uh, after this video is over, the live stream, the the, of, the replay will be available. So. You can check it out. You can check out your favorite parts. You can find some, hey, Duncan said this. You know, okay, here's a little thing. Everybody calls me Duncan. Literally, my first name is Taylor. If you didn't know that, now you do. That's why I signed Tay on a lot of stuff. Yep. 
That's the second. <laughs> I told you. All right, let's shake them up. Is there a white or something? I wonder if I put a gold base down first. Will the neon pink, like that's the thing. How do you get the neons to show up? It literally doesn't look like it showed up on this. And it definitely didn't show up on the little topper piece. How do you get the neon colors to show up? <clears throat> there's not a white, is there? Yeah, there is. But I don't want white. There's literally no white in here. I don't want to put white. I don't want to see any white. But I do want to get the neon pink to show up. I'm getting stressed out again. Coffee break. Whew. Breathe. Coffee. Mm. Mm. That's good. Much better. All right. So, um, a lot of you asking about coffee tumbler. Why aren't you drinking out of a mug instead of a tumbler? There, I have a little uh, hint for you guys. A little, little secret insider stuff. I do have a line of coffee mugs, color coordinated. Um, coming out as soon as I transfer my I know, I know a lot of you've been on here you've said hey you've been saying this for a while but I'm trying it's really hard it's not working out transferring my website from GoDaddy to Shopify because you can do a lot more things on Shopify you can see a lot more analytics like literally if I change the file I can find the people that bought this file and just send them the update like I can't do that on GoDaddy and I don't know why but it is what it is. So here we go. It's for the light. It's lampshade time. Here it is. I'll base this in gold yesterday. It was really freaky because it was splotchy as all get out until it dried. And then it dried so nicely and smoothly. I feel like if you just want a gold lampshade, you could literally just spray it gold with this stuff that I found in my gold, goldiest paint um, video from two, two videos ago. The, the beginning, I love the beginning and the end also, where I did the Indiana Jones kind of like um, reenactment. That was fun. That was fun. Okay, we're going to start with what well, says neat. Wait a minute. I mixed the lids up again. How do you keep doing that, man? That's literally, oh, that's shook now. No, big deal. You can, dude, the neon is not, I think the neon is not mixing up. I think I might need to, because it's really clear looking. It's not shaking up enough. <clears throat> if it didn't shake up on that time, it's never going to shake up. Right? Okay. This is it. I guess I'll put neon first. I guess. I'm just going for it. Let's just go. Neon. Neon is... Let's do... Let's do both at the same time. Oh, let's do both at the same time. Ha ha ha. Now I'll switch hands. Oh gosh, I dripped that all over my hand. I gotta pick up the lid, the lampshade. I'm putting a lot. I'm doing a lot. I'm just going for it. This is the last thing that we're dipping today. So I'm just gonna do it all. Oh, oh. Okay, we're good. I thought I spilled it everywhere. I'm, I'm flicking these things pretty hard. Okay, next color. What's the most dominant color? Let's think about this. This is, this is make it or break it here. Last attempt. We're going to go, let's do lavender. Where'd you go? There you are. Why are you hiding from me? How'd you get pink on the top, I wonder? Okay, here we go. Lavender. Lavender's nice. It's a nice color. You know what? I bet. Like, you see how that's kind of like a gradient? I bet if you could do it in here, like, oh, I might do that one day. Not today, because I don't have anything else to dip. But like try to purposely put the colors in a specific spot. Or as some of the kids say, Pacific, which is wrong. But it's okay, you can be wrong. You don't have to say everything right. I rarely do, okay? It's not English class, it's art, okay? There's no, now this one turned out kind of orangey looking. And there is some of that on there. Like brownie rust orange, even though it just says it's regular orange. Whoa, oh, there's a neon orange. Why not? The pink didn't show up. Maybe the orange will. I don't know. Maybe the neon orange will show up. Well, that was a lot. Hmm. Fingers crossed. You know what? I'm going, I'm going all out here. I'm doing both yellows. The lemon and the... I call this sunshine. It's, it's literally a word I can't pronounce. Middle, middle glia, but a bit... Mit, mit glib? Like, what, what is that? It's yellow. Just say yellow. It's not like, 
What the? Okay. There's not that much yellow. What are you doing, dude? I don't know. I literally don't know. I think. Oh, I kind of see that. It's kind of neon green. I might not like that. That might have been a bad idea. One way to find out. Now the dark blue. The dark blue is a nice contrast on the shoe. It's not really that much on there, but it does make a nice contrast. That's another thing. That's purple. Don't grab that. We already got that big dog. Now this is the regular blue. I do have like a, a light blue. I don't think I want to use that. Okay. Did I finish it off? Did I have everything? Is everybody accounted for? Let's go back with the uh, regular Rosa. Is this Rosa? Oh my gosh, it's covered. Can't even see what's going on anymore. Whoop, 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 whoop. Okay, I'm good. I'm, I feel like, let's just swirl it. Let's see what happens. Oh, big swirls here. Big, big moves. Oh boy. That neon um, green. It's not green. That wasn't green, was it? No, it said lemon. What the heck? It doesn't look lemon, that's for sure. It looks like uh, neon green, like what I said. Oh boy, that might have screwed this thing up. Oh, I'm not feeling good about this. What do you think? Give me some comments, give me some feedback. I need your energy, people. Is this gonna turn out good or is it gonna be crap? Literally, the shoes and everything's come out pretty good so far, but I didn't put neon green in it. Even though it's supposed to be lemon yellow. These colors are um, not very accurate to description. Okay, here we go. Lampshade time. Let's just do it. I'm going to go slow. I'm going straight in because it's already at an angle. So we're just going to go and I might just twist it as I go. Slightly. Nothing crazy. Oh, we're in. We're committed now. We're down. We're under. We're underwater. We are fully submerged, ladies and gentlemen. Oh boy. I feel like the shoes were not as stressful as this. Cause I, I really have no stake in the shoes, whether they work or not. Cause I can't wear them for one. And two, um, this lamp shade needs to be good so that it could go with the beautiful lamp that I put on my turner. Will you get out of the way? shovel all the water around here people okay it's underwater it's not getting any different what do you think did we do good i need to see some comments come on please 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 i need your energy i need to be reassured before i see how disastrous this is Let's, at least let me feel good for a minute okay <laughs> pull it <laughs> don't get impatient i know look patience grass up uh it's gonna be great just do it okay fine 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 it did get a little the inside. It looks kind of red. Okay. <gasps> what? Okay. 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 Yeah. Okay. It's a lot of pink. That is a lot of pink. Literally, it would have been neon if the neon showed up, right? Hold on. Ah, there we go. Get down. Get off me. I'm coming around. Should be going around the table when he comes. Shake off the water. Here we go. All right, check it out. Come here. Get over here, Mr. Light Dude. You're, you're the star. Look at that. Whoop, get over here. I am not mad about it. The, that's perfect, literally, except for the only thing I wish was that the dark pink neon showed up. But really, that's not too bad at all. That, that literally works. Listen, listen. This being fabric and lampshade, I had no idea if it would work. Look how cool the inside looks too. That's pretty red. Dude, what if you put a light in it? Will it show through? Oh, oh and the fabric texture. Yeah, it does look cool with the other lines going the opposite way. I didn't even plan that. I could tell you that I did, but I didn't. I had no idea. That, oh, look at that. Let me back up a little bit so you can get a full gaze of the beauty. This, I love this. And that color right there, that I thought kind of brownie, orangey rust looking. There we go. That's my favorite part, I think. It's weird. I thought that part was hideous on the other one, but it, it literally looks great. Got a lot of water on it, it's okay. 
So now what we do, we just set this bad boy to dry. If there's uh yeah, it's just water drops sitting on top there. Uh, I, that might be a glob. Should I flatten it out? I'm literally, I'm, I don't know why I'm asking because I'm doing it. Uh, I wonder if it would, would level out if I hadn't have touched it. It probably will, but literally it doesn't matter. Dude, look at that piece right there. Look at that side. Oh, that is gorgeous. Gorgeous. Here, there's me. Okay, I think that's successful. Okay, let's unwrap the shoes. I guess we can unwrap them. It's still kind of wet, but we're going for it. Let's find the end of these bad boys. Uh, where are you? Let's just cut it. Like I'm not too confident that I got, look, it's got a little gap there. It let, raised up a little bit. Oh, I got, I would get the dullest one that I have. Yeah, that's, that's not gonna work. I got another one over here. They literally look identical. This one's sharp. Yep, there we go. Oh, okay, here we go. Get it, get it. Oh, look at that contrast. Oh, that's so nice. Hold on, let me turn this light down. We're blinding the whole world here. Oh, other way. There we go. There we go. Look at that. Oh, let's, let's get the reveal here, the ASMR stuff. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, yeah. Dude, those turned out fantastic. And I was really nervous because I used so many colors, but what? Look at that. That's fantastic. I mean, the bottom, if you didn't want the bottom color, it'll wear off when you wear them, or you could just tape them up like I did the sides here, right? Sheesh. Okay, how can I hold the bottom? Literally, there's nothing there. Okay, don't grab it with the gloved hand with the paint on it, okay? <clears throat> Need to dip my shoes. Hey, send them to me. I have a P.O. box. Um, <clears throat> that's what I was saying earlier. If there's something you want me to paint or do, message me and we'll work it out. And like, give me some details. Say, hey, I want you to do this live, blah, blah, blah. We might can uh, work something out. You know what I'm saying? I have a P.O. box is listed on my about page. Let's, let's get these bad boys here. You, people send me stuff to paint all the time. Like even motorcycle helmets. Oh, it literally did great. I was worried that where it gapped out, it just kind of fades. That's pretty dope looking, literally, literally. Sheesh, that's Picasso right there. I just might frame that mug and hang it on the wall. Sheesh. Okay, let me take the other glove off, let, let go. All right, and then I don't know if I can pick this thing up. Let me try. I'll stick my giant um, paintbrush through it. There we go, there's this guy. That turned out really nice. I am, but I can't get into it. I'm too blind. This, this though, oh yeah. Somebody said they're a rhinestone in a pair of shoes. That sounds pretty dope. That turned out great. And it matches the, what do you call it? Lampshade perfectly. All right, that's it for today. If you have any suggestions, comments, watch us over, leave me a comment. Connect with me on Instagram, throw me a message, tag me on TikTok, or join, like I said, a couple people on here while we've been on have joined the private Facebook group. It's literally free, and I don't know why I'm coming over here, because I can't reach the thing to turn it off. Okay, there we go. We're here. We're done. Oh, I love throwing darts. I'm not good at it, but I like it. Hit that thumbs up before you leave. Hey, Catherine, Kathleen, sorry. Kathleen, thank you very much for that reminder to everybody Make sure you hit the thumbs up, share this video if you like it. If you enjoyed it, if you want more of it, I need your feedback, I need to know. So other than that, the shoes were great. We can hydro dip more stuff, that's fun, that's fun. I could do some live airbrushing. But if you need more, I have a whole playlist listed in the description of hydro dip videos that I've already done. There you go. So you don't even have to let this party be over. You can continue the show and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks. Appreciate all of you. And God bless. 